A-A-N, Ellen, that's a ninja. I'm about to graduate from college. Any top shelf ninja advice for snagging a job? All right, there you go. Wait a minute. Did you say top shelf advice? Well, 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 look who we got here. Somebody decided to give up the beast to get himself a responsible ringtone and a big boy wallet. All right, I was just going to give you well advice. But if you want the top shelf advice, I'll get you some of that. But it might rip some hairs off your chest, brother. So get out your cherry scented pen and your Justin Timberlake notebook because I'm about to give you some interview tips. Yeah. Be negative. Not about the job, just about the interviewer. This is an ancient ninja technique called You Suck! And basically what it involves is making that guy feel like a worthless pile of pig guts because then the only other thing in the room you is gonna look like a golden bowl of awesome chips don't try and relate to the interviewer common ground is a killer they already have one of them you want to be as different and exotic as possible i mean if that guy's wearing a suit you want to be wearing a speedo if his hobby is cycling your hobby should be giving people testicular cancer definitely want to have an accent just whatever accent you can come up with that's why canadians have such an easy time breaking into show business because they look like americans but then they've got that titillating exciting exotic accent Thing. And finally, with the exception of the interviewer, speak nonsensical gibberish to anyone else you meet at the company. That way, when he goes around asking people what they thought of you, they'll say things like, I had no idea what he would say. And it was like he was speaking some language I've never even heard before. That will make you look amazingly smart and brilliant. Thanks for the question, Alan. I look forward to stopping your human resources soon. And that'll be fourteen fifty for the advice. It was top shelf. hey up! Tell me about yourself. Make me. What do you know about our company? More than you think. Why should we hire you? Because I said so. Now go to your room. What can you do for us that someone else can't? Show up. That was me subtly threatening that I will kill anybody else that you hire except for me.